Hello everyone, it's Jesse here. This is going to be a quick video. Um, it's late on the 15th. It's late. Uh, I've been outside with my dogs, uh, sweating and playing with them. And uh, I'm hot. It's hot. I've got my hair really cold, but it's still hot. I'm still, I guess the heat's just sticking with me, but... <clears throat> Anyways, um... I had turned on the camera just a minute ago, and I had a really big reason to turn on the camera, but I don't remember what it was, and I'm still, I'm like, it was right on the tip of my tongue, and I flipped my camera open real quick, and I was going to go right at it, and it was just like, I just had like a blank moment, and that, I don't know, I don't know why I couldn't remember, and I still can't remember what it's going to be about, so I'm going to tell you what, I'm going to tell you anyways, um, so like, um, my beard, yeah, it's, um, somebody on YouTube, I discovered someone on YouTube, he commented, I don't know if he's been a subscriber of mine for a while or what, but, um, he, um, like, teaches you how to, to maintain a beard, keep a beard, grow a beard, um, I was like, after I watched his video, or one of his videos, I was like, hmm, should I not cut it, should I just trim it, and whatever, but, now I know, like, no, I'm gonna, I'm going to, uh, I am gonna cut it, even though it's a year, six months, and 15 days old, um, I am gonna shave it, and, uh, but I'm gonna leave mustache and, you know, goatee, uh, but I plan on growing it back out, but taking much more care of it. When I first started growing it out, I took much better care of it than I have in the past several months. Well, the past six months have been pretty kind of hard on me. I mean, I'm not trying to say anything or get you to feel bad for me or anything, but it's just been a, a trying time in my life. And I even let my ivy die that I had for over a decade growing. Yeah, I even let my ivy die and many other things. So, yeah, it's been a crazy time for me. I'm not going to go into details. If you want to look it up, you can look back at my videos if you want to. But anyways, um, I'm going to shave it off and... I'm going to start grow, start it over and take be much better care of it. I did take care of it, like I said, but not in the past several months. So, um, well, not in the way it needs to be taken care of. A beard is like, literally, you, you have to take care of a big beard or else it just becomes completely unruly. Like, I can still comb mine, but there are some men that just let it go and don't ever brush it, and it, yeah, it's not pretty. But anyways, um... I've been outside, so I'm I'm sweaty, I'm nasty. It, it was humid, hot today. I sat outside with my cousins, my new, well, not my new cousins, because, but, well, kind of my new cousins. One is, uh, he's 35, and uh, it was good getting to talk to him some. He's married, and he has two children. It was good. He's my second cousin, and his children are my third cousins. Anyways, we had a good time. But, um, anyway, this video's going to be short. Uh, let's see what else I was going to say. Oh, this is this is important. This is not the reason that I turned the camera on a while ago, like the big reason, but this is important for you to know. Um, I did, I'm just going to warn you now, I did vlog about the Orlando shootings, the mass shooting, biggest mass shooting in American history. Um, I'm going to warn you now, it will go up on the 16th. I don't know what time. I'll set it to some time. I'm just not sure what time. Um, but I don't know, like, I don't know what's going to happen, you know, I live in a small town, Bible Belt, Southern Arkansas, uh, homosexuality or bisexuality, transgender, uh, anything but, heter anything but heterosexual, really not accepted around here, I mean, there are a few people that I know, but not, no, it's not, like, they're not out, and they don't dare go out, but I am out, and it, it, that's the scary part. So I do break down in the video, but I do warn you in the video before you get to that part that I do break down, and um, I don't know what's going to happen after the video comes out. I don't know. It could, you know, if it's just a few of my YouTubers, maybe I get like 150 views or maybe 300 views out of the 1,700 subscribers that I have. I don't know. What happens if it goes viral? If just the right person runs across it, sees it, shares it, and it just goes viral? Like, there's no tell. I don't know what's gonna happen or could happen so um anyways that i'm warning you that's coming it's coming 
Uh, it was recorded two two days ago at least. Um, I just been shy of putting it to public. But uh, see anything else? What is that important? I, I see it's me talking myself in the head like what the hell was you fixing to talk about Jesse because there was something important I was going to talk about and I can't remember what it is watch it be when I'm laying in bed when I'm just about to sleep it'll pop in my head and I'll be like oh that's what I was going to tell them <laughs> that shit happens to me all the time anyways I'm going to get off here like I want to keep this vid short because I don't want to take forever to upload but uh yeah I even looked on like every tab I have open to maybe get my memory to it's still yeah um oh I made a post on Facebook and it was a plea to everybody that was a YouTuber that I'm friends with on Facebook uh, to go to a particular video and report it as terrorism um there's a video out there um this kid I'm saying kid I don't know. I don't know what what his age is, but his name is Ku Klux Caleb, and his profile picture is a picture of a Ku Klux Klan member, and um, he uploaded this video. Um, I'm assuming it was a GTA game, um, where in the game there's a what a, seems to be a gay nightclub called cockatoos or something like that anyways he takes a gun and pretty much reenacts what probably went down in Orlando on the outside and uh, he he titled it Orlando shooting and uh, I know at least 10 to 15 people have reported it uh, but it's still there and I tweeted YouTube I tweeted like even I, t I tweeted like everybody and their dog that I could think of that might could help us get this taken down because it's disgusting. I, I hope the family members do not run across this video or see it because it could bring, it could make them think painful thoughts. Can you just imagine, you know? But, uh, you know, it's still up there. And uh, I don't think it should be. I don't know what you guys think. You know, kids play that GTA, or you know, more than kid, more than adults play it too. You know, it's all killing and shit. But see, I'm a, not a gamer, but I still don't think that it should have been right that he filmed that in front of a a gay night club on there and shot all the, shot the people and and then uploaded it to YouTube and titled it Orlando shooting. I, I I think that's a little too far. And you, I tweeted YouTube directly, and they have not replied or done anything about it. So what have you there anyways I'm gonna get off here and get me a shower and go to bed early love you guys peace look out for that video it'll it'll be uploaded but like I said beware I do break down I don't a lot of you probably don't want to see me cry but I cry so peace guys love you